Hello, Steve Gross here with Conversion360. We're here today to talk about the first 10 steps to successful online business. Let's get started. The very first one is you need to become a keyword guru. Emphasis on guru. If you don't already know what keywords are all about because they are the GPS of online marketing, you need to understand what keywords are used for. You can actually understand what the customers are looking for before they do if you understand keywords. They will route you to your future success. You need to do a keyword analysis or do some analytics on your keywords. Analytics will tell you the volume. It will tell you the quality of the keyword. It will tell you if you're even selling the right products or services on your website. So the analytics will tell you a lot. Don't skip that step. Do a competitive analysis. Okay? Take a, look, take a look at your first three people, the first three listings of your competitors under that search term for each search term or each major search term. Analyze their websites. Understand what keywords they use. Understand how they're optimizing their site. Understand what they're offering on the front page, for instance. The next step, number four, is your marketing channels. Okay? There's no less than 15 marketing channels available to you on the Internet, including pay-per-click, organic search, which is free, Affiliate marketing, like uh, share a sale or commission junction. You have social marketing, social book marketing. There's a lot of different channels. We can go into that later. But you need to identify which ones you're going to be using because what you're developing down here is going to depend upon, or largely depend upon, what channels you're going for up here. Next, you want to do your architecture. You want to architect your site. You want to design it. You want to make sure that the categories you have listed, the keywords that you're using, the picks that you're going to develop, how you're the basic structure of the website is, where you're going to give the customer the opportunity to navigate your site. You want to know that before you put your website or your blog form so forth together. Now you're ready. Now, I'm going to put a website up here, but it could be something else. Now you're ready to design your website. So let's get started. Let's do that. Let's design it based upon the information that we gathered here. The next step is to promote. Now we're ready to promote what we've done for the first six steps. So promote it. Go into that channel, start promoting. Do it slow, especially if you're in pay-per-click. Pay-per-click can cost you a lot of money. You need to learn pay-per-click well in advance of really stashing a lot of money in there. There's ways that we can show you how to do pay-per-click, and we will show you on future videos. Okay, number eight is analyze the keyword success. Okay? When you're analyzing your keyword success, what you're doing is relating the keywords that you're using up here through your promotion and your web, your title tags, we'll get to that later, your content of your website, all of these things. You want to go back and you want to say, which, see which ones are successful, ones that are proven, are proven keywords that are going to produce the results or are producing results that you're looking for. Okay, number nine, A, B, or multivariant testing. Extremely important for conversion. Test different landing pages, test, test different picks, test different conduct, uh, content on where you're, uh, where you're sending the customer to land, where they're entering your website. Multivariant testing, a little bit more difficult, a little bit more on the professional side, but multivariant testing is you take a group of different things, if you will, different ways to navigate, different picks, so forth, and you group those together in different patterns groups and then test them out against each other. Okay, last but not least is always review. Constantly, constantly review what you've learned up here all the way back down to here. And if need be, you may find some things out down here when you've root process that you did wrong or maybe you assumed wrong up in these places. You can save yourself a lot of money. You can make yourself a lot of money by make sure you constantly review, modify, and adjust, change, whatever it is you think you need to do. That's it. Thank you very much for watching the video. We look forward to seeing you next time and look forward to us covering each one of these tens in future videos more in depth. Thanks again and uh, have a good day.